Hey YouTube, so here's an update on the 30 gallon tank. Uh, this is right before I get a couple of new fish in the coming weekend. I just fed them a uh, brine shrimp cube from Hikari. You can see two of my L400 plecos out. The other two spend most of their time in the back of the tank. They each have a distinct pattern so I can tell them all apart. My male has recently started coming out more too. So the male has kind of made his own territory. I'm sorry for the noise. The male has kind of carved out his own territory in the back here, in this kind of like little grotto right by whatever this plant is that I still don't know. There you can see a good shot of it on the left. I don't know what that stem plant is yet, but it's growing like crazy. But the male's carved out his own territory. I turned this cave around for him. There's the female that currently hangs out with him. The male is the most timid of the four. We might see him under here. There he is. There you can see that female has a distinct pattern also. And the male the breeder that I got him from said that the males had more of a gray-white instead of a white. The females have a very striking white color to their stripes, whereas the males have a more kind of dappled gray look to them. <clears throat> uh, assuming that's the determinant of sex, I think they're a little too small to have the the whiskers yet. but. Assuming that's the determinant of sex, he got it right with one male and three females for me. So we'll see, we'll confirm that. And, uh. His behavior is a little bit different than the other three, too, which also leads me to suspect that it may be. indeed the other sex. So as you can see, the crypt here has started really turning brown. I don't think it's wilting at all. It's not melting. It's still growing new leaves, and its new leaves are also that color. So I don't know what it is about it, but we'll see. I might be getting a new lighting fixture for this tank soon. So we'll see if that changes it. It only seems to be happening in the middle, but that's where the most intense light is. So I'm wondering if that's what the cause is. This one has the most water flow, but less light. This has the most light and mediocre water flow. And this has very little flow and low light. Alright, so I'll just sit back and watch the tank for a little bit. 
there's Iggy before I watch the tank I guess Alright, I see I'm running kind of long. Thanks for watching, YouTube. I'll cut it shortly.